In 2004, the city of Rockland, known as being the granite capital of the West, completed a gateway entrance to the city off of I-80 and Rockland Road. The city spent a reported one and a quarter million dollars on the structure. There is reports that there was something peculiar about the structure. We are sending our best reporter, Leah, to investigate. Rocks in Rockland. Hi, I'm your reporter, Leah. If you can see on this gateway or this rock, you can see that this is cement, not your usual rock. They made this in a factory. That is so wrong. This gateway is supposed to be your, you know, gateway into your city. It's supposed to be so beautiful. They could have made it even more beautiful by take, instead of having cement, making real, having real rock instead of these phony pigs. That is very interesting, Leah. But where did all this granite come from? Let me explain how the granite came to be. Over 150 million years ago, there was a mountain here. And it, over the years, it slowly washed away, leaving these beautiful granite outcroppings. These are known as plutons. Are there places in Rockland we can actually see 150 million year old plutons? Hi again, I'm here at the Brigham and Hawes Quarry. It is one of the oldest quarries in downtown Rockland. It is so beautiful. You can see so much granite here. Ansel Adams, a famous photographer, thought the plutons were beautiful too. There are lots of plutons to visit in Rockland. At the Johnson Springview Park, you can see the Maidu bedrock mortars. The mortars may be up to 5,000 years old. Off of Rockland Road, right behind City Hall, you can see the Big Gun Court, also known as Capitol Quarry. Before it closed, it was the last working Rockland Quarry. Look over the side and view the granite plutons that are millions of years old. Again. We are here at a different location now. We are here off of Whitney Oaks Drive. It is so beautiful. We are at a park. It's so beautiful you can play so much. And actually we, you can see a lot of animals around here. And look, real granite plutons. Isn't that amazing? Hi again. We are still at the park. Did you know there is an exciting part about this park? Guess what? There are bedrock mortars, also known as grinding stones. These, we believe, are from an Indian family that once lived here. This is an exciting venture all about rocks and Rockland. Back to you in the studio, Jesse.